Hi guys, voiceover Kathy here. For Wednesday, I decided to tackle some of the image collection tasks by combining them into a collage. I got all of these photos from Pinterest and saved them to a dedicated TAW Week 5 folder. You could honestly just save your image collection to Pinterest and just leave it at that, but I decided to go one step further and print them out for a collage because I am an overachiever. But really, I like having tangible images that I can tape up to my wall or hold in my hand because I remember them more easily. And don't get me wrong, I love Pinterest. I use it for mood boarding and inspiration all the time, but there's so much like abundance of photos that I can't keep all of these aesthetically pleasing images digitally. Like, I'm just gonna forget them. It's also why I like collaging, because I can just cut and paste as many photos as I want onto a single piece of paper. I can see everything in one place, but it still maintains that, like, abundance and chaos. It's also a mental exercise for me, because I have to be strategic with the placement and how big or how small to cut each photo so that everything fits on the page. But anyways, if you're curious as to what photos I've chosen, they have to do with the prompts about what I want to do in my 20s as well as a wish list of things that I want to own but don't have. So I've got things like traveling to Europe, waking up in a Parisian apartment, owning a nice leather bag, having stacks of books on my floor, cooking good food, inviting my friends over to my place the Fleur Father Figure perfume, and Hobonichi Techo spreads. Speaking of Hobonichi, I actually got my Hobonichi package right as I started putting my collage together, so that was a cool, funny moment. A moment of synchronicity, if you will. Part of this is also me just wanting it to be fall. Like, I'm so freaking tired of the sunny weather, and at least in Denver Metro, the leaves haven't changed color yet which is why I included images of like Gilmore Girls and fall alleyways and indoor bookish things to do, so there's that. But yeah, here I'm just gluing everything together on the page, getting creative with the slits in some of the photos to make the objects overlap. But yeah, overall, I had a lot of fun making this collage and I absolutely love the result. I'm so proud of it. What is up everyone? Happy Friday. The last couple of days have been pretty sunny and nice and warm, but as nice as those days were and how productive I was, um, I'm just ready for it to be fall. Like I'm so tired of it being like sunny and warm all the time and I'm just like constantly sweating. But today is a very cloudy, moody, rainy day. Uh, it's getting colder, so I'm wearing this um, sweatshirt that the company I interned at uh, gave to me for free, like as a free gift. So what better time to wear it than now? Um, and I also have my tea right here and I put like Kramer in it and it tastes really yummy. The tag fell off. Oh well. Since today is gonna be rainy and cloudy and moody, I thought what better time than to romanticize fall and get into the fall spirit by baking cookies and watching Gilmore Girls. And that is what I wanna do for my artist day today. I always associate fall with like Taylor Swift and pumpkin spice and Starbucks and fall cookies and spices and the color orange and warm weather and all that. Um, but I started seeing more images pop up of like Gilmore Girls being a part of this like romanticizing fall aesthetic. Uh, like I've been seeing YouTube recommendations of Gilmore Girls playlists. I've been seeing images of Rory Gilmore on like Pinterest and Tumblr and all that. So I'm like, okay, maybe I'll take this 
as a sign to finally watch Gilmore Girls because I I've never watched Gilmore Girls but I've actually been meaning to watch it because of all these images that I've been seeing around me that have to do with Gilmore Girls. So I don't know, again, I feel like today is just the perfect weather and the perfect time to do that. So that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, I'm back. So I just finished watching the pilot episode of Gilmore Girls and I just love the vibes of it. I mean, even though it's a pilot and we're just kind of setting things up, I just really love getting to see like this mother-daughter dynamic, uh, but also just like the relationships and the people around this mother-daughter duo. Lorelai and Rory are beautiful style icons. Like, I want to look like them. But also, just like the color palette, the camera work. Like, I don't know if they put like some sort of grain filter over the shots as they were editing, but I don't know. I just really love like the, the graininess of it and Overall, just like the fall atmospheric, like academic 
vibes of it all. It's seven seasons long though, so I doubt I will be able to finish it this year at all. But yeah, I really, I really like it. Yeah, I guess this is it for week five of The Artist's Way. Next week is week six, so we're gonna be at the halfway point which is honestly kind of insane. I am still going to keep making videos after I finish uh, The Artist's Way, but I think for now I'm just gonna steadily go through this program and I might take a break after week six. Um, I'll probably do like a separate vlog or maybe just skip a week and not vlog so I can actually focus on other stuff going on in my life. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I hope you guys are getting into the fall vibes and the fall spirit and i will see you guys next time bye